Hello, this time I want to present a monocular. This is the Vortex Solo 8x25. It's a nice little monocular. Uh, I chose it and I'm testing it today as you can see here in the mountains with the view of the Adriatic coast. As I said, I'm testing it here because this is meant to be used for my trekking and trailing adventures and that's why I like something that's small like this and lightweight but the vortex is also internally fog proof and waterproof and as you can see the the build quality at least it seems quite robust and my first impressions uh, impression is that it actually is quite sturdy I dropped it already once and as you can see you can see nothing because it's quite robust. Uh, there's also basically the same size and everything else and dimensions but it's a 10 by 25 instead of an 8 by 25 but I chose the smaller magnification uh, because as I said I use it for trekking and trailing so I don't need it for really spotting more for orientation so a wider field of view it's better for me and also when I'm running on a trail and huffing and puffing a bigger magnification is harder to stabilize in a hand so again a smaller magnification is better yeah so this is it I don't think it has an eye relief here the only there are only two minor downsides downsides first of all this um, focus ring is quite stiff so this is a bad thing because obviously you cannot easily adjust it with one hand but also it's good because when you're running around it will not accidentally twist and the other downside is that it doesn't come with uh, uh, lens caps but it comes with a small sheath as you can see here nothing special but it's okay for me okay now I will try to show you how it looks through the lens. Let's see if it works. Well, hand holding it through the lens and my cell phone camera didn't quite work as intended. But anyway, I think uh, the optical quality is uh, quite decent, especially for the price of around 40 to 45 dollars. There are the big German names that make also monoculars with higher specs but also for a lot more money but I think for this price this is a really decent uh, uh, quality monocular. Thanks for watching.